Special day, um, special race. Um, that's three generations of, my, of Wiggins racing on this track. Uh, my grandfather and my dad. So yeah, it was, it was cool. Oh, it's, uh, there's nothing like it. There's, uh, there's nothing like the atmosphere here. It's, um, it's special. It's like the, the mecca of cycling for, for, for cycling fans. So. That day, I was just I knew I was knew, I knew I had a good shot to win, and um, yeah, I just I felt really good. Um, at the start of the race and I just needed to work out who was who was strong and who was the best people to follow and uh, yeah I just uh, I, I knew I could win um, and yeah I did so it was a special day it was a uh, it was it filled me with a lot of confidence and um, I've known since then that I can I can do it really so it was, yeah it's it a special day for me and my family as well uh, yeah I hope so I think Paris is a bit, the next one in Paris is a bit 50-50, um, but for sure LA after that, I'd love to, that would be a dream come true to, uh, to uh, ride the Olympics, that would be good. Next year I want to, uh, I want to be, I want to win the Worlds TT and like my mate, my, my, my friend Josh Tarling and, um, and be world champion on the track with a track world championships are a couple of weeks after. So. Yeah, that's the main goal for me. And also uh, Paru Bay would be nice as well. So. Yeah, uh, that's something that's, we've just, yeah, not, we're not started planning, but it's something I've spoke about with a few people. Um, I think maybe at the ne end of next year is the most realistic uh, time to do it, uh, to finish my time as a junior. I think that'll be quite good. Um, and that also means no one can beat it whilst I'm a junior. So I think, uh, I think, I think I, I think what the record is 50.7 or something now. I think that's uh, doable for someone like for someone with my engine. So I think uh, I don't know, I'm planning to have a little go at have a little go at the pacing over the next couple months. I think I'm going to try and do like half an hour at the pace, see how it feels. Uh, but yeah, it would definitely be um, something I uh, we're planning to do next year. Yeah. I'd like to do it in Manchester, get a crowd in. I think I'd like to try and do it properly and get some sponsors involved and some fa um, some fans in the in the velodrome at Manchester. I think or London that would be pretty cool. So yeah, so I think we'll look out at the end of next year for maybe our record attempt. Here. Oh, that that was mean. You know, I'm, I mean, uh, people could say what they like about Lance, but he's um, he's. Yeah, he he did some bad things, but so did everyone else, I suppose. And yeah, it's, um, yeah, it's still it's still unreal to be around guys like Jan and Lance and George. Um, yeah, they they still I, I still believe they're heroes of the sport. And um, yeah, he's I, I admire his mentality and things like that. And it was pretty cool riding with them and getting advice from them. And yeah, obviously I've known Cav for a long time, so it's like it's like uh, being around my brother. So yeah, it's, it was cool.